Oh, okay, student, let's see what is there in this question. A negatively charged sphere is falling through a magnetic field. What is the direction of magnetic force acting on the sphere? So what is the direction of magnetic force acting on a sphere? So uh, we have done uh, quite many uh, these kind of questions now. And if you are uh, following my YouTube channel, have you watched like uh, the playlist for 5.4? You might have seen like there are so many questions that we have done on this and I have also discussed the right hand palm rule so many times now and that even in complete details. But let us do it once again. So right hand palm rule, there are like, this is completely my terminology. This is my hot favorite. I don't use Fleming's right hand or left hand or something and I do not use any other law. I use right hand palm rule because it is quicker, easier, that is why, more effective. And uh, I have divided this right hand palm rule into three. So if you are uh, a member on my uh, subscription plan and uh, you have accessed the online course that I am posting there, so you can find these videos and you can watch these videos like what is what kind of rules am I talking about? But here, uh, let me explain you this right hand palm rule type two. So type two is about finding the force on a charged particle. Uh, like the positive charge is going or the negative charge is going like that. So what happens here is like now, like again, this is for three types. One is positive charge, then negative charge and then electric current wire. So we would be talking about the negative charge. So uh, the fingers be pointing. First of all, we would be using our right hand and keep it hard. It should not be like this but it should be like this. Okay. So fingers should be pointing towards in, in the direction of magnetic field. It means from north to south. So magnetic field is towards right. So I can keep my fingers like this. Okay. And my thumb will be pointing towards kind of opposite direction of the velocity of negative charge. If it is a positive charge, then it will be the same direction. If it is a negative charge, it will be in the opposite direction. So this is the magnetic field like this and electron is going down, but I would be keeping my thumb in the upward direction. So my palm is clearly looking towards the screen. It means that the, the force which is experienced here, that will be into the page that will be going into the screen. So into the page. So the answer will be D. So I can write here that palm will give you the direction of force on negative charge. So be very particular. This is only and only applicable on negative charge. In the case of positive charge, we do not use the opposite direction. We use the actual direction of the velocity, which will be downwards. Okay, dear students. So this is how we do this question. Please refer to my old videos. Please refer to the playlist um, referring to the topic 5.4. Or if you are a new student, like in the new syllabus, then it it will be in a different playlist. By the way, so you can find those things. You can go for the online course that I have posted. You can watch those videos to understand what is type one, type two, and type three. Okay, dear students. This is Professor Varun. Thanks for watching the video. All the best.